So now let's see how we can work around with the crop tool inside of Pixlr E. So in order to work around with the crop tool, on the left side, you can see that there's an icon called crop. And if I were to click on this, then you got get this crop handle right here. So now by default, you can resize it the way you want. And then if I were to press enter on my keyboard, it gets cropped out. I can go around onto the left side and then click on crop right here. And you can also define the within height according to what you like. Let's say, for example, if I were to go on to width right here and press 500, you can see that now there's a 500 range of width right here. And I can also work around with the height. Let's say, for example, 200. Then I got 500 by 200 pixel of height. I can go around and select a portion as per my liking. And I can eyeball it and then resize it according to my will as well. So once I do that, you can see that this is the free constraint, but you can also go towards a particular ratio. Let's say, for example, if I were to select ratio right here, right now it's one by one ratio. Let's say, for example, if I need something by 16 by nine ratio, then you can see that this is what you have. So if I were to resize it, it'll resize according to the ratio that you select right here. Or you can go to a specific size right here. Let's say, for example, if I want exactly 400 by 400 pixel right here, it'll just resize it out accordingly. So I'm just going to go around 200 right here, 200. So I'm going to go for size right here, 200 by 200 pixel. Then it'll exactly go around with that particular ratio as well on the size. So on the preset, there's different uh, ratios that you can choose. So you can choose 2.1. 5.4 right here, 19 by 10. You can go around onto Facebook profile. You can go for Facebook cover and so forth, and it'll choose out the specific uh, setting for you. So you can go around right here, place it wherever you want, and you can reset it out, or uh, you can apply to apply the changes. So once you do that, you can see that this is the crop that you see. And that is how you can work around with the crop tool inside of Pixlr E. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.